Hi there, it's me, Mr. G. Um, I am sorry that we can't be at school, but right now it's good to stay at home to make sure everyone stays safe, keep ourselves safe, keep around us safe. I can tell you, I am sorry I can't be at school, and I know your teachers are sorry you can't be at school, and so are your classmates. But uh, we get through this little bit, we'll come out stronger on the other side, and we'll be able to be together at school all the time. So what I'm going to be doing is doing the social skills lessons that I had been doing with you in person. I'm going to be doing them right here from my home and you're going to be watching them and working with them from home. And hopefully you can have a good time doing so. So what we're going to do today is we're going to sing the learner song. We're going to practice the rules for what happens when someone else is talking to you. It could be an adult, it can be a friend, a teacher, whatever. Uh, we're going to have our lesson and then we'll be done. And I hope you enjoy it and I hope you're able to um, have a good time at home. So, all right. So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna start with the learner song. Um, we started doing this before school let out. And basically what I want you to get to practicing is the hand motion. So you'll see me doing them with the song. But when they say focus, focus, you know, you put your eyes up like this to focus on the teacher. Uh, when they say listen, um, you're going to point to your ears because you're going to use your listening ears. When they say use your self-talk, we want you to kind of point to your head. When they say be assertive, once you put your hands on your hips, like you're being a tough guy. And when they say use eyes, ears, and brains, we're going to go use your eyes, your ears, and your brain. Um, now we'll do it together. Okay, so I'm going to try to put it on here and we will get going. Okay. See. Okay, here I am. So uh, I'm going to push play. So just do the motions with me or with the video, and we should be okay. Focus, focus, listen, listen. Use your self talk. Be assertive. Focus, focus, listen, listen. Use your self talk. All right, so here's the motions. Here we go. First, you focus the eyes and ears and brain. Now you listen. Make sure you listen. Use eyes and ears and brain. Say I can do this. Focus, focus now. Serve it. If you don't get it, just ask for help out loud. All right, good job. All right, here we go. First, you focus, get your attention, use eyes and ears and brain. Say, I can do this. Heard it. If you don't get it, just ask for help out loud. All right, let's see if I can stop where I normally do. Okay, now I will bring my screen back. All right, here I am. All right, let me check the screen. Okay, so now we're going to practice those rules you do when someone is talking to you. Okay, um, there's four things you should always do when someone's talking to you, and you kind of do them at the same time, but you have to focus your brain to get you to do it. So, the first thing you do when an adult is talking to you is show eyes watching. You want to focus on the adult, you want to put your attention on the adult or friend talking to you. Okay. The next thing you do is show ears listening. So first you have to focus your attention on the adult. 
then you have to listen to what they say because if they say something important, you may have a question or they may have a question for you and you wanna be able to answer. So first you focus with your eyes, then you focus with your ears. Okay, the next one is very important. When an adult is talking, what should you be doing with your mouth? What kind of voice should you have? You should have a quiet voice. So when an adult is talking to you, you should be looking at them, you should be listening, and you shouldn't be talking. We each take our turn talking. When an adult is talking, it is their turn. Then when they're done talking, it'll be your turn to talk. So we have a quiet voice. Finally, after you are focusing your attention, you're looking, you're listening, you have a quiet voice, what should you be doing with your body? Should you be going crazy, moving around, playing with stuff? No, you should have a still body. You should have a body still. So when an adult is talking, we do those four things at the same time. So we start with focusing our eyes, then we focus our ears, then we have a quiet mouth, and a still body, it ran over there, I can't get it. So those are the things that we should do when an adult is talking. All right, so now we're gonna start our lesson. Um, what we're gonna do today is we're going to focus on focusing and paying attention. Uh, when you're at home, it could be even harder, but it's good to practice a skill. So what we're going to do is we're going to see our picture today. So what I want you to do is look here. I'll put it right here. So this is Amy, okay? Um, Amy did not pay attention or focus while her teacher was talking. And now that it's time to actually do the work, she doesn't know what to do. She is very upset. Look at her face. How do you think she feels? Look at her eyes. I look at her mouth. I look at her shoulders. What kind of emotions do you think she feels? Go ahead, let's see. Right, I definitely think she looks sad. Look at her mouth. Her mouth is turned down like this. You know, if she was happy, she'd have a mouth like this, but she doesn't. She's sad. She's sad because she doesn't know what to do, all right? Um, you could say she was worried. She could be worried that she doesn't know how to complete the assignment. Um, and she might even be upset or frustrated. Frustrated means you are just kind of upset. You don't know what to do. You're like, Arr. So um, I think we've all been upset at times. I think we've all been frustrated. And I want you to give me a little, little thumbs up if you've ever been frustrated. Yeah, me too. So what we're going to do today is we're going to talk about how we can pay attention and not get frustrated or worried. All right. Before you can listen, you have to focus your attention. When we sing our song, the first thing we do is we focus our attention. And if you focus your attention on the adult, you will probably know what you're supposed to do. So we're going to learn to concentrate. We're going to learn how to do that today when an adult is talking. So we are going to practice keeping our attention on something. I'm gonna play a little sound here on my phone and we're gonna see how long you can listen to the sound and focus on it. So, all right. So we're gonna concentrate. We're gonna put all of our attention on the sound that I put on my phone, okay? I want you to tell yourself. So we're gonna use some self-talk inside. I want you to tell yourself to ignore all their distractions in your house. So whatever could be going on right now, try to ignore them and just focus on the bell you hear or the sound, whatever I play, okay? What I want you to do is as long as you can hear the sound, I want you to put your hands up, put a hand up like this. And as soon as you can't hear the sound anymore, put a hand down. All right, let's see. I like this one. So I want you to concentrate on that sound only, not even me, on the sound. Right, you should not hear it anymore. Good. So when you are listening to things, listening to people, it's important to tell yourself it is time to listen and it's time to 
focus on the teacher, tend to focus on the person talking to me. It's hard. There could be a lot of shiny things going on, a lot of noise, a lot of commotion. Maybe a student is in the back and they're acting silly. Maybe your brother is at home and he's running around or your sister or your friend or your cousin. But you still have to tell yourself to focus on the person talking so that you can uh, hear what they have to say and get that information from them. Okay. So Amy, when she is uh, getting information, she needs to focus on the person talking. Okay. Now, um, next time the teacher talks, she focuses her attention on the teacher and listens to the directions. While she listens, she remembers what she hears and thinks of questions to ask. So while a teacher is talking to you or a parent, you should be looking for things to ask questions about. Maybe you're not sure about something. You know, ask questions. Um, these skills are for learning to help her stay focused and become a better learner. All right. So today we talked about specifically using self-talk. So while you're getting a lesson, you may say focus, ignore distractions, ask what can I do next, and then tell yourself maybe you need to calm down. We also learned about focusing attention, you know, how to concentrate. Use your eyes, ears, and brain. So we talk about focusing. You got to focus your attention, use your eyes, ears, and your brain. And then, of course, again, ignore distractions. So we're going to practice how to focus attention. You're going to learn a little bit about me. And then I'm going to ask you what you learned and see if you remember. Maybe if a parent is with you, they can help you. All right. So I'm going to tell you some of the things that I like. Okay. So my favorite season is the summer. I love the summer because it is hot, I get to work outside, and it's long, okay? So, my favorite season is what? The summer. Why do I like the summer? I like the summer because it is hot, I get to work outside, and it lasts a long time. So, let's try it again. So, you need to focus right on this guy right here. So when I'm talking to you, you should be focusing right on me, not on mom, not on dad, not on anything else that's going on. So my favorite season is the summer. I love the summer because it is hot. I get to be outside and it lasts a long time. Good, 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 good. So, um, you know, it is important to focus attention on the person that is talking to you. So what I want you to do is practice that while an adult is talking, tell yourself to ignore the distractions around. Try to tell yourself to just put everything else away and concentrate right on that person. Focus on them using your eyes, ears, and your brain, all right? We're going to finish today by going into, we're going to watch a, another quick video about the Be A Learner. All right, see if I can get this down again. Okay. So, wait with me just for a second. Okay. There we go. Be a learner. Okay. Well, there we go. Sometimes. Technology doesn't really work all that great. Here we go. So we're going to listen to the Be a Learner song. All right, let's see if we can get this going. Here we go. Sorry. 
One more time, guys. So when my next video, we will be focusing more on that self-talk. So I hope you are um, focusing more and practicing how to focus. There we go. It's hard to focus when there's a lot of noise going on. So I hope you are practicing focusing and I hope you can go outside and play if you're able to or stay inside where it's nice and safe. And I can't wait to see you again. Uh, thank you.